The Prophet ﷺ says that Allah has said, Yabna Adam, O son of Adam, O human being. And this is a singular address. So Allah is talking to each and every single person individually. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, إِنَّكَ مَا دَعَوْتَنِي وَرَجَوْتَنِي As long as you continue to call out to me. He didn't say pray. Not even pray. As long as you continue to call out to me, as long as you have the capacity to just say, Ya Allah, Oh Allah, I need you. إِنَّكَ مَا دَعَوْتَنِي وَرَجَوْتَنِي And you continue to have hope in my mercy. غَفَرْتُ لَكَ وَلَا أُبَالِي I will forgive you and I won't even mind. It's not even a big deal. Don't worry about it. He then goes on to say, Ya ibn Adam, O human being, O each and every single person, Lo balagat dunubuka anana sama. If your sins were to reach the limits of the sky, if your sins were to reach the limits of the sky, this is how my teacher explained this hadith to me. I want you to imagine to explain it, to understand it. Every time you, one person, committed a sin, a cup appeared in this world. And then when he committed a second sin, a second cup appeared. And then when he committed a third sin, a third cup appeared. And so on and so forth. Till the point that this person kept committing sins, kept committing sins, kept committing sins, till the point that the entire world, north, south, east, west, became completely, the earth became completely covered with cups. There was not a single inch left on the surface of the earth. The entire earth was full of cups. But then guess what? That person keeps sinning. And there's no more room on the earth, so where are we going to put the cups now? So he committed a sin again, and now you put it on top of the previous cup. And then it kept stacking on top of that. And this person kept committing sins to the point that eventually the entire world, all the way from the ground to the sky, became completely filled with cups. One person committed that many sins. One person. Lo balagat dunubuka anana sama. And then what does he say? Thumma astaghfartani. And then after all that, thumma, then after all that, astaghfartani. You asked me for forgiveness once. You sincerely, honestly asked me for forgiveness once. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, غَفَرْتُ لَكَ وَلَا أُبَالِي I will forgive you and I won't even mind. That's how merciful and forgiving Allah is. That is who we are dealing with. I want, I want you to really, really internalize this. This is a huge issue we are dealing with today. That is who our relationship is with. That is who we are dealing with. 